Hey gang, Charles for PremierGuitar.com. Uh, I'm hanging out with John at Lakeland. And uh, John's got this pretty killer prototype of a six string bass here called the uh, working title. The 60 11. No, 60 wor 11. working title. So tell us about this thing, man. This is a little bit, there's some familiar touches, some. Well, it's a full, uh, it's a full 30 inch uh, six string bass as opposed to a baritone guitar. So it's uh, one full octave down from a guitar. So it's got a low E string, which, so you can play a, you know, familiar chords. It's, it's pretty deep, it's pretty low, but uh, it's got guitar string spacing and uh, custom, uh, custom gauge strings, three P90s, and a five-way selector that gives you a bridge position, gives you a bridge middle, Gives you a neck and bridge position, middle and neck, and neck only. Volume and passive tone. And it's this thing's just full of personality, and it's got a lot of different tones in it. Why'd you opt for uh, P90s? Um, it really suited the instrument really well. Um, it gives a really bright and articulate mid, uh, upper mid-range. And uh, it just is, well, once, you, once you hear it, you, it's, it's really obvious it's like the perfect pickup for this for this instrument and uh, so it's it's cool it'll be out in June of, uh, of this year this we've got a couple little tweaks that we're doing to the neck taper and uh, and, and and that but it'll be in our it'll be in our mid-year catalog you want to play it a bit and sure. let's hear what it sounds like got a really broad range of tones it's really a lot of fun and it's really its own instrument in a way yeah and I and I've had a lot of a uh, lot of fun with it through guitar amps too um, especially running through um, some thick analog delays and a bit of a brighter uh, clean sound you can it's like a, a single act soundtrack machine it's really cool a lot of recording dudes are probably gonna have some fun huh yeah and uh, so this is uh, the closest thing that Lakeland has to a guitar at this point, it's, uh, the six-string bass, but we're really excited about it. Cool, so looking at June, huh? Looking at June. All right. Real quick, we've got what we don't have at the shows. We've got our new, the return of the Daryl Jones signature bass, which was uh, a very popular bass for us in the time, and we were able to uh, re-sign Daryl Jones from the Rolling Stones to put out his signature bass. So thought worth mentioning, that'll be out in March. All right, a lot going on in Lakeland, man. Absolutely. John, thank you very much. Thank you. This is beautiful. Thanks a lot. Take care, guys. This is Charles for PremierGuitar.com.